Well, happy Sunday, YouTube. I'm back in my closet attempting to do some work in here to try to create a, a closet that I enjoy. And when I talked to, at the beginning of the month about wanting to revamp my closet, I was speaking specifically to the, the physical structure of the closet. As I started to sort through all my clothing, I realized um, it's not just the physical aspect of the, co the, the cottage. <laughs> it's not just the physical aspect of the closet that disturbs me. It's also the contents of the closet that disturb me. I've been feeling kind of ho-hum and frumpy. Some of this is because my clothing is worn, and some of it is because I don't really think I like the bulk of the clothing that's in my closet. Two years ago, I did the KonMari method, and I went through and I kept everything that sparked joy, and I purged anything that didn't. I also went through a little bit of a metamorphosis where I had gone in my younger days from being into like goth and dressing a little bit like that and then moving to New York City wearing a, and continuing to wear a lot of black. Then I had a color analysis done and I started wearing all the colors of soft autumn and I got rid of all of my black. But then a few years ago I started to feel I, like, I didn't feel like the soft autumn was fully serving me. Like, I didn't want to go to see uh, a heavy metal show or something locally in a peach or mint-colored sweater. Or... But now my closet is mostly black with a few touches of color. And even that, that isn't feeling right to me. So what I'm dealing with is the clothing that I do like or is kind of serving me still isn't serving me. It seems like everything in my closet looks pilled, dirty, dingy, and just worn out and saggy and sad. And it's making me feel saggy and sad. So what am I going to do? I am going to go through my closet again. It shouldn't take me very long. I have four dresses for work. I have two black skirts, one patterned skirt. I bought that patterned skirt recently. I wore it once and I haven't worn it again. And I have to say, I don't know if it's because it doesn't feel like it's the right season for that skirt. Or again, there's something about that skirt that just, it appeals to me on some level, but yet when I put it on, it, I don't know that I feel right in the skirt. Here are two examples of some things that, you know, should work for me, but they really don't. So this is a huge, like, scarf shawl thing, and it's kind of a heathered tan. Now, according to Color Me Beautiful, this should work for me as a neutral. When I wear this, it just, I feel, it depresses me. I want to get rid of this, but then I also need to find something that is equally as warm to wear in its place. And maybe this is something that I should have done when uh, I had the luxury of time. And I'm not doing this to try to, you know, give myself license to shop because I'll be honest with you, I am not one of those people that loves to go shopping. And here's another piece. Again, it's like a wrap shawl. It's gradient color. But this mint green is actually in my soft autumn color palette. But the thing about this is it's like owning um, a shitty dog or cat. Like I've worn this with uh, some black clothing and then I just have lint. I'm still wearing it when I'm no longer wearing it. Here's a quick run of some things that I initially pulled out of my closet, most of which I th I'm pretty sure I'm going to you know, donate, sell, whatever. But uh, this kind of Wednesday Adams collar. I think I wore it twice. Some jewelry that I've never worn. Um, some t-shirts. I don't feel like I need uh, a ton of black t-shirts. I also have quite a few. I have two more of these. They're little tank tops. They're not showing up great on camera. I need to make a decision. This is uh, Athleta. This is that uh, fuzzy wuzzy leaves some fur behind. This guy, I don't know, just a white sweatshirt. I end up looking 
like a pig pen after about two minutes in white. Black velvet jacket, I think again, I bought it and never wore it. Some sparkly black sequin top, very sad looking cardigan. And then over here I have a couple of vintage slips and I really do love wearing these half slips. I don't know that I need three yellow vintage slips. So this is it so far. Here are my shoes, obviously. I hate this big blank space, but I think maybe I can put a mirror in here so that I can do my makeup. Yeah, the top of this is still uh, messy and unorganized. I have to sort through my jewelry. But right here I have uh, three hand knits that I made, one sweater, and then two basic pullovers. Here are uh, maybe two or three nicer t-shirts that I might wear on the weekend. My workout wear, athletic socks, whatnot. Uh, in here I have my tights and then one or two pairs of dress socks. And then up here are the rest of my undergarments. These two hat boxes have some hats and the more delicate hats. And then I have uh, two winter hats that I wear vintage hats and then I do have clothing in the laundry like I said I have two dresses that I still need to hang but basically here are two dresses so I have four dresses uh, two black skirts this is the skirt I mentioned that I think it's super cute I just don't know that it's me this purple heavy wool jacket I have five cardigans and then uh, maybe two tops to wear under the cardigans, maybe three. So that's an issue. There are definitely holes, kind of gaps in my closet. There is duplication. I mean, how many vintage black cardigans do I need? How many cardigans do I need? I clearly need some tops. I clearly need some bottoms. But uh, right now, the closet looks a little bit better than it had. I feel like I made some good progress with going through my clothing, getting rid of things that no longer serve me or no longer look good on me simply because they're worn out or I don't know, they're just not, they don't feel me or they don't make me feel good when I wear them. I'm also happy with the first kind of pass of having this bookcase in my closet and seeing how that works for me. I'm giving myself the entire month to kind of sort this out and figure it out and see what I need to do. Who knows, I may end up with a six drawer dresser and that'll be the end of it. But the one thing I know I need to do is uh, I, I clearly need to do some clothes shopping and that's not going to be fun. It's not something that I enjoy doing, but it's clearly something that I need to do. And I have no, I literally have three tops and then five cardigans. I, I need a few more tops to wear under the cardigans, or maybe I can just start wearing the cardigans as tops. That's an idea. At any rate, thank you very much for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you next week. Bye.